Hello, this is Lime, and welcome to race number 15 of the NRL Credit One Bank Cup Series for the Bojangles 275 here at Darlington. Let's take a look at the starting lineup. On the pole, you have Renato Moreno and Cole Raymond, then Roy Rivelton and Joshua Teppensaw, then Owen Finley and Ricky Freeman Jr. running Jimmy Johnson's 2012 uh, Lowe's throwback. We have a few throwbacks in the field here. Then you got Mark Sachi and Diego Lopez. Brendan Yodel and Christian Elder, Joshua Harrison and Nathan Stapleton, uh, Christian Vargas and Nelson Reeves, Audrey Baranowskis and Ryder Chisholm, Carter Joey and Trey Smith, Matthew Burnett and Anton Charbois, Rod, uh, Lance Smith Jr. and Rod Hayes, Jack Rubleton and William Brock, Caden Lynn and Code Red, Marcus Wells and Brett Sierra, Gil Williams and Griffin Lynn, Dan Harrison and Juan Rodriguez, Peter Onjak and Riley Sperley too. Jay Jefferson and Cara Bell, Jose Mills and uh, Brandon Bill, David Haas and Mitchell Collins, and running out the last row uh, is Stephen Cohen and Owen Miles. Renato Moreno, uh, I want to say, yeah, he won last race at uh, the Charlotte Bowl. Bowl. Uh, his first career win, looking for another career, uh, his back-to-back -back, uh, wins here uh, at Charlotte Bowl, Bowl and now the Darlington Raceway. Uh, beat story if he could end up doing that. Anyways, pace car in. And Renato Moreno and Cole Raymond lead us to the green flag in the Bojangles 275. Mountain and Earth is snuff. Uh, Trevor Lake Mountain. We'll be lap one for that Richard Ch uh, Childress Racing Trevor Lake. Now here comes Owen Finley with the race to get off the number eight car. And it looks like he'll convince him to get, to the, uh, get past the number eight car, but it looks to clear him out of the turn four. Like for Robleton into the wall there. Oh, let me screw up there. That's uh, hopefully that's better. You can see the results. Uh, now Roy Robleton looking back for the lead. Renato Moreno. Renato Moreno uh, just not had a great start to the race on the high side. He just get it down low quickly. Roy Robleton back. Anton Charbois did not have a good turn in the race in that IK9 uh, Toyota Camry uh, running. Let's see if we can find him. He is running currently, so he's going to go through the lead. He's running currently, he keeps so, uh, admired pretty far back in the pack. But Owen Finley into the race lead, and Rob Rolton really caught the wall there. Yeah, so more on back, uh, or just about at least. Yeah, single file back here. Single file front. See the flyby coming up here on the uh, front stretch. Cars going up blistering speed. Steve Cullen. Four in second. And now Roy Rolton looking on for a second here. Even though the bullshitter Renato Moreno is currently seventh place. It would be 
VK uh, Racing number 23 for their camera. That completes uh, lap number 7. This second one I want to say this season. Uh, one did opening race or the uh, series premiere. Uh, the Daytona 500 after Peter Andrek had a bad luck in that race. So definitely not a good memory for him. Herb Wilson looking to catch the number 43 car. Uh, I'm sure, I'm pretty sure from my memory that would be the first uh, brother duo because I'm pretty sure these two are brothers who went in this series. But I'm not sure there's any other brothers in this series. So we will have to figure that out. File here. Not sure if they're going to try to make a move. Now, Jacker will be on the back stretch. Anyways, Roy rolls into the lead. Sorry, I was uh, looking away for uh, a quick minute. Anyways, Roy rolls into the lead here, lap 12 of 23. So it's pretty much in the right gap. Uh, so we'll see what happens here. But as I say that, the this pack kind of forms up and I can catch him. But I'm just a quick uh, drive by of the field. Didn't wreck there. 
the 10 and Nelson Reeves got turned into the wall. Bill Williams and the points clear answer to our wall got involved in that. I don't know how they get a rest. That's insane. Wow. I, I really can't believe that. I mean, it's not going to happen. You're kidding. Huh. Yeah, this really slows up Nelson Reeves. Hate to see it for him. Caution's out. And yeah, does fall to the number 10 for racing back. It'll be oh Finley. This might actually end up ending the race. Yeah, what happened with uh Nelson Reeves? Let's take a quick look at what happened with him. Oh my gosh! Uh okay, so Reeves just hit just got stuck in the wall. Oh gosh! Okay, never mind. Three rider Chisholm got involved in this wreck. From the same day that Nelson suffered, Scott glitched into the wall. And he gets hit by his teammate David Hodge. Uh, who else involved there? I think the nine, yeah, William Brock involved. So yeah, crazy wreck here uh, that just happened. Uh, let's take a look on board. Yeah, just nowhere to go. Sandwich in between two flipping cars. Kind of hard to avoid there. No more of David Haas next. Oh my, oh my gosh, as you see him having a car slide over his roof, man, mere inches from hitting him right in the face, and then one more time, let's go in the cockpit of uh, Ryder Chisholm in the number three RCR Chevy. You see him all eyes, he just got really tight and went into the wall. You kind of see that if I go staring to the left there, couldn't get out of the lane time. So yeah, that brings out the caution. Owen Finley to the race lead. With, uh, with five to go here. So we'll see what happens here if this ends the race or what. Not quite sure what we'll be seeing here. Twenty-one. Out there or not? So we gotta hope that uh, pace light. And they are out. So it'll be a one-lap dash for the Bojangles 275 here. Surprisingly, Ryder Chisholm still rest, uh, racing around. The two retirees were David Haas and Nelson Reeves. Anyways, pace car in. And Owen Finley gets an amazing jump and leads us back to the green flag. One to go here. Can we find a way to get into the 43 and pass completely without having to wreck him? 
We'll see you on the back stretch for the final time today. What can the what, what can the eight do? He'll get close to his bumper. Out of turn four. For the final time. Coming to the checker flag. Owen oh, Finley is like, I don't know what happened there. I was pressing those buttons. But Owen oh, Finley wins the boat table 275 here at the, Darlington Mo at the Darlington Motor Speedway. Wow, what an amazing uh, finish there. Thought the eight was going to get, a, uh, get around him for the last lap pass and uh, just wasn't able to do it. Congratulations to Owen Finley. His first race in since the Daytona 500. Now let's go to victory lane for the uh, number 43. So you got to take a quick look at the uh, the standings there, but let's take a look at the marks. Actually, wait. We're going to take a look at the results first. Excuse me, it's been a while since I've done this. Anyways, Owen Finley first, Robertson second, Cora Raymond third, Brandon Gold fourth, Ricky Fearing Jr. Uh, fifth, Renato Marino sixth, Diego Lopez seventh, Joshua Tuppen saw eighth, Lance Smith Jr. ninth, uh, Matthew Burnett tenth, uh, Marcus Sachi eleventh, Christian Elder twelfth, Matthew Swells thirteenth, Jay Jefferson fourteenth, Jose Mills fifteenth, uh, Audrey Baranowski sixteenth, Joshua Harrison seventeenth, Nathan Stapleton, 18th, Trey Smith, 19th, Peter Onjak, 20th. Carter Joey, 21st, Donald Miles, 22nd, Griffin Lynn, 23rd, Mitch Collins, 24th, Paul Anton Charbois, 25th, Girl, Gil Williams, 26th, Rod Hayes, 27th, Brandon Bill, 28th, Stephen Collins, 29th, Jack Crivelton, 30th, Dan Harrison, 31st, Riley Spurley, 32nd, Code Red, 33rd, Brett Sierra, 34th, Carvel, 35th, Carter Chisholm, 36th, Cade Lynn, 37th, uh, one Rodriguez, 38th, William Brock, 39th, Christian Vargas, 40th, and then the two retirees, Nelson Reeves and David Haas, find out the field. And let's take a look at the point standings. Anton Charbois has a 56 points, uh, 56 point point lead over Owen Miles in the number 38th, and Christian Elder in the number 3, uh, in the number, uh, 92 3rd, Rod Hayes, 4th. Cole Raymond, 5th, Brandon Old, 6th, Lance Smith Jr., 7th, Diego Lopez, 8th, Mark Sachi, 9th, Peter Onjak, 10th, Ryder Chisholm, 11th, Nelson Reeves, 12th, Mark Bolton, 13th, Joshua Harrison, 14th, Renato Moreno, 15th, Trey Smith, uh, 16th, Ricky Freeman Jr., 17th, uh, Jack Rivelton, 18th, Matthew Burnett, 19th, Owen Finley, 20th, Brett Sierra, 21st, Joshua Tepinsaw, 22nd, Brandon Bill, 43rd, David Haas, 24th, Jay Jefferson, 25th, Juan Rodriguez, 26th, Jose Mills, 27th, Gil Williams, 28th, Mathis Wells, 29th, Carter Joey, uh, 30th, Mitchell Collins, 31st, Carr Bell, 32nd, Audra Baranowski, 33rd, Riley Spurley, 34th, Caden Lynn, 35th, Nathan Stapleton, 36th, Code Red 37th, William Brock 38th, Stephen Cole 39th, Dan Harrison 40th, Christian Vargas 41st, and Griffin Lynn way far behind to the next person in 42nd. Anyways, I don't know if I mentioned this before, but we are doing a wild card system. Uh, anyways, uh, what I should explain is top 10 make it, then we'll have two wild cards, uh, which is people with the most, with people wins inside the top 20 or the, or the first two people win inside the top 20 and that's Renato Moreno uh, currently having that uh, those two wild card positions so we'll see how that shakes up over these uh, next few races as you see these this points battle is just insane uh, 21 points 2 points 3 points 5 points 9 points 4 points 2 points from like 14th to 14th to 20th so it's going to be insane here to watch and witness what hap what it's going to happen here in these next few races we have about 10 more races until the next race before the chase anyways next race uh is the worldwide technology 300 at gateway so we'll go ahead and see what's going to happen there 
I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the Bojangles 275. Congratulations to the winner, and I'll see you for the next race at Gateway. Bye, guys.